when it comes to combining Europe and, and or reflecting about Europe and, and the United States, um, we're, go, we're of course speaking about transatlantic relations and the importance of, of transatlantic relations. Um, it was in a way for me interesting to see that when I assumed directorship of our Institute of European Studies uh, five years ago, um, there was some concern about uh, a dwindling interest uh, in Europe uh, among American students. Um, that we had the feeling that, you know, those times that students who would study art history would naturally study also European art history, right? Um, that when we had students studying political science, they naturally would study European politics, that those times were over, that Europe was to become a continent among others, right? Um, and um, that at the same time, especially considering the location of our university on, on the West Coast, that the focus would increasingly be on trans-Pacific relations on, on Asia um, and much less on, on, on Europe. Um, but what we have seen um, in, in the past years, though, is that, especially among the younger generations, um, you do see an increase, an increase in interest on where Europe is going. Um, unfortunately, sometimes this interest is a result also of problems that, that Europe is facing. Uh, problems relating to Brexit, of course, populism, uh, the whole immigration question, um, um, the Catalan question. Um, so many of the challenges that, that Europe is facing is, is something that definitely does attract uh, also the interest of, of students um, in Berkeley. Um, and we clearly see that when we look at, at the events uh, we organize, at our institute, because we have we have weekly events um, um, at our institute, and we have seen that that the interest of students of, of, of younger students uh, coming to 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 listen to lectures and also engage in the Q and A after the lectures with the speakers that this interest has clearly increased, um, and and that once again um, you know convinces us that the work we do is important work. Um, and, and for me to do that work uh, in the context of an, of an EU center that is named after Jean Monnet, and now to have this, this opportunity to be with you uh, speaking about Europe in this very important space here in, in Lausanne, named after Jean Monnet, where the archives of Jean Monnet are, is of course also to me a very special occasion, uh, Gilles, I must say that. <laughs>